course, we are going to learn about both ArcGIS Pro and QGIS combinedly. ArcGIS Pro provides us many dynamic tools to do our GIS task smartly, easily, and finally, standard presentable format. QGIS, which is previously known as Quantum GIS, is a free and open source GIS software. Now, let's see what we can do by using QGIS. Although it is a free software, but by using QGIS, we can do our any types of GIS work easily. Even by using this, we can do many difficult GIS tasks easily, smartly by using single click. See this 2.5D map, which is developed by using QGIS. Now let's see what we will learn in this course. If you don't have ArcGIS Pro software, then don't worry. In this course, we will learn how to get ArcGIS Pro software free for 23 days and how to install this in detail step by step process. Not only that, we will learn how to get QGIS software, how to install QGIS step by step process. We are going to learn user interface of ArcGIS Pro and user interface of QGIS in detail. Map browsing toolbar including attributes toolbar and map navigation toolbar. We will learn all kinds of options and tools inside the contents of ArcGIS Pro interface and also what kinds of properties and tools we have inside the panels of QGIS interface including browser panel and layers panel and not only that we will learn also some magical tips and tricks inside the layer pop-up menu both in ArcGIS Pro and QGIS interface and we are going to learn how to work with raster layer, vector layer, Google Earth single KML layer, as well as Google Earth group KML layer, both in ArcGIS Pro and QGIS interface. Yes, we will learn all of this in detail explanation. We are going to learn how to create shape file and another types of layers. Even we will learn also how to create layer groups which is very useful for any kind of GIS task. And not only that, there are many magical tips and tricks are waiting for you in this course which you can use both in ArcGIS Pro and QGIS. So if you want to learn all of this then enroll in this course and enjoy GIS.